Is Riverdale? Well, we oh, I knew it. It's karma's a bitch. Oh well. Karma's a bitch. <laughs> Holy sh. Oh well. Oh! Karma's a bitch. Oh! I've seen this! <laughs> I love this! Karma's a bitch. I get it. I already get it, right? It's like glow up. I want a towel or something that I can just throw at the camera and then I'm perfect. Oh well. Karma's a bitch. Oh my god, that looks so badass. Yes! Karma's a bitch. That is so cool. <laughs> I love this. It's kind of like the don't judge me challenge. Is there one where they're like before and then they show themselves like with like a master's degree? Oh well. <laughs> Karma's a bitch. I like this challenge. I think it started as like an Asian trend. Asians are so cool. They're like the best. <laughs> Not that I'm biased or anything. Karma's a bitch. Okay, this is too good. Look at this motherfucker. He eyes you. I think it's cool. Like that's beautiful. Like costuming. They are really good. Mine's just like put on a little mascara. <laughs> oh well. Karma's a bitch. Oh, man, he's got a tattoo on his neck. Holy cow. Ooh. Did he go get a tattoo? Did he get a tattoo on his neck just for that video? Oh well. Karma's a bitch. Damn! The couple that transforms together stays together. I just want one person to stay the same. Karma's a bitch. Yes! <laughs> Nothing changed on that one. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it didn't work. No, you should have just stayed in it. Owned it. That one's more realistic. That's basically what happens. I'm gonna try something new and then it just never looks good. It's just silly. The whole thing's silly. I'm so happy this exists. So we have some more videos to show you in a second, but that was the karma is a bitch challenge. Karma is a bitch. Okay, okay. The trend started on a Chinese app that we believe is pronounced Doa Yin and was picked up by multiple publications, including BuzzFeed, whose reporter Cassie Cho uploaded her favorite examples to Twitter. The challenge is now spread all over, so we have some more to show you now. Oh, okay, I'm excited. I'm curious to see how like the rest of the world takes it. Oh well. Karma's a bitch. <laughs> Nice. You have to beat someone up. Yes. Got that sandy look from Greece. Hey, I know her. <gasps> Busy Phillips. Is that Busy Phillips? <sighs> yes, Queen. Oh, they f killed it. Whoa, what? Oh, well. Karma's a bitch. And Spider Man! <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> That's cool. Didn't see that one coming. That one took me by surprise. Karma's a bitch. Her true identity. <laughs> I hate when that happens. I love when people take a trend and like creatively add to it. If there's supposed to be a message, I don't understand it, but I think it's cool. This is the stupidest thing. <laughs> Fun stupid. So do you have any ideas to like where the inspiration of this comes from? No, definitely don't. I recognize the music. I know that's Krayshawn. I loved that song. The thing that comes to my mind is that Don't Judge Challenge. They were kind of like making fun of supposedly unattractive people or features and it sometimes came off as offensive. So now we're gonna show you the clips that kind of spawn this challenge. Okay. Everything all right, Nivita? St. Clair's had a car accident. St. Oh, Clair's from had Riverdale? A car okay. Nick, Is this Riverdale? He will be coming. Oh, I knew it. It's gonna take several months. Oh, well. 
karma's a bitch. Damn. Little did she know she'd become iconic. I know her dad's like a bad guy, but I mean, I don't think my parents would be okay if I'm just like, oh well, karma's a bitch. Like, what did you just say? Oh well. Karma's a bitch. <laughs> oh my gosh. Nice. I just love when like little things happen and then the internet takes it and sparks it into something way more. That's so cool that like from you know, just that one edit, uh, they turned it into this craze. So that was a clip from the show Riverdale. Oh, it's Riverdale, okay. I've heard of Riverdale. It's a very popular show, but I have not watched it. Some people are so creative and I applaud them for that because watching that clip, never would I have thought to do anything like that. Some people have been comparing this challenge to a challenge that the adults had reacted to before, the Don't Judge Me Challenge. I have not heard of that. Yeah, which is so f***ing stupid. That's why I kind of like made me cringe a little bit when I was watching it because it gave me don't judge me challenge vibes. Do you remember when you first saw that challenge? It was here. So is that supposed to be like ugly? The don't judge me challenge was a selfie trend that showed an unattractive angle with heavy makeup before shifting to another more photogenic self-portrait. Oh, cool, cool. Okay, that makes sense. I could totally see that being more related actually than the Riverdale scene. After watching, you know, the Karma is a Bitch challenge, uh, do you think the two are similar? What do you think? I mean, they're a bit similar in what they're doing, but this one is definitely a lot more like fun and natural. The other one's just like, look how good I look. I like this one a little bit better because it's more of like a genuine glow up. With the other one, it sounds like the message was, you know, about don't judge a book by its cover, right? This one doesn't have, like, a, in my opinion, I don't think there's an impactful message that's being delivered. On the Don't Judge Me Challenge, I know people, like, made fun of, like, uh, specific attributes and stuff like that, like, things that were, like, other people deal with, whereas this this is kind of like people are making fun of themselves. So it seems like the challenge kind of started in China, uh, but as you saw, it's now being posted by people from other places as well. Uh, what do you think it is about this challenge that, that kind of made it appealing to people from all over? It's fun, it's short and sweet. It's really easy. I mean, there's really no language barrier. Everyone loves to see a before and after type of thing. Just a big reveal is always fun. It's just dramatic. Sometimes it makes people feel insecure, like being bullied or made fun of when you're younger. And then when you feel like you're kind of like hot shit when you're older, you want to show it off a little bit. So finally, we're gonna give you the chance to try the challenge yourself. Yes. Yes, are you ready to do this? I'm excited, yes. Cool. Oh sh time to make me look good. Oh well. Karma's a bitch. Karma's a bitch. Oh well. Karma's a bitch. 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 Thanks for watching us in another episode of Adults React. Subscribe and hit the bell like Jesse Nielsen. If you like this episode, then hit that like button like GamerGirl43. Let us know what to react to in the comments like Derek Tucker. Thanks for watching, guys, and remember, karma's a bitch. Bye, guys. <laughs>